Welcome back, everyone. I've got Mrs. Sharon Dollarhide. She is a state outreach veteran service officer. And uh, first, welcome to Midday. Uh, thank you so much for having yes, me. Yes, we are glad to have you. And you are here to talk about a Veterans Town Hall that is coming up. Uh, Mrs. Sharon, why don't you start with the info? When is it right. and where is it and who should be there? Be glad to. <laughs> uh, this is open to all veterans as well as their family members. It is an opportunity for them to be able to ask questions, to mm -hmm. seek what a uh, benefits they may be eligible for. We'll have the VA, the VA there from uh, Tuscaloosa as well as from Jackson and Columbus. Oh, okay. There'll be several other agencies that will be there to provide uh, any answers to any questions. Humana will be there uh, as well as Tri-West because there was a merger and so it's going to be Humana for the military. Okay. Uh, there will also be um, the different agencies. Social Security Office will be there to answer questions that deal with Social Security and the, right. the benefits for the mm -hmm. um, Veterans. Mm -hmm. uh, also, we're going to be there with uh, more of the Vietnam books. Awesome. Uh, these will be free to all the veterans who served in country in Vietnam. They'll need to bring their DD 214s with them when they come to the event so that we can give them their books on sure. spot. Very nice, very mm -hmm. nice. Okay, so uh, again, this is May 22nd at 10 uh, at the American Legion Post yes. 69. Uh, right. Talk to me about why are events like these so important to hold in a community that has veterans? We have a strong veterans yes we do here. a lot of veterans don't realize what their benefits are and so there's no packet that has every benefit that's eligible for them and the benefits are always changing mm -hmm. so if they have questions even questions about claims that they have po that they have uh, pending sure. uh, the status on the claims mm -hmm. there'll also be people that will be there to enroll them in the VA system uh, oh, there's a lot nice. of veterans that do not even take advantage of the VA itself so right. there'll be people there that can enroll them check on claims file claims for them and why is it important that veteran family mem veterans family members be there too do you think that support system is definitely needed and it is mm -hmm. you have some that are deployed and so they don't know what their benefits will be when they come back this is an opportunity for the family members to seek but there's also benefits that are for the family members themselves like if their if their loved one has passed away mm -hmm. or different uh, benefits they may sure. be able to use to help their veteran my last question for you is uh, what's the reaction you get when you hold veteran town hall meetings like this and you know you get reaction from veterans who do come what what do they tell you after this they're appreciative of the information that they get because they they aren't aware of the benefits yeah. that they might have and so this is an opportunity for the different agencies to to honor the veterans right. at that time there'll be coffee and donuts and oh, we're you're more than better. welcome to come out <laughs> and join us for some <laughs> Absolutely. Well, thank you, Ms. Sharon, right, thank for you all for the me. valuable information. Uh, it is, again, Tuesday, May 22nd, American Legion Post 69. That is 308 Cheppy Drive in Columbus. It starts at 10 a.m. Call 325-6867 for more info. Again, Ms. Sharon, thank you for being thank here. Thank you for having me. All right, we're going to send it to a commercial break. We've got uh, Mr. Food coming up. Wondering what will be on the 